We know they're being taken very seriously. There are not only the allegations that you heard from Wang Li, Li Qiang, who says he is a former Chinese spy, and as you he heard, he says he was involved in espionage and other activities, including violence and kidnapping in Hong Kong. But we've also heard through that 60 Minutes program and the nine newspapers reporting here in Australia that another man, a man by the name of Nick Zhao, who was found dead in a motel room earlier this year in Melbourne, uh, was is alleged to have been um, a, po a person who the Chinese were pressuring to run as a political candidate uh, to try and infiltrate the Australian Parliament. Now, we had a federal election here in May. Uh, he was found dead in March. But this allegation goes back a year ago. We know it's being taken deeply seriously because the domestic spy agency, the Australian Secret Intelligence Organisation, issued a statement last night, which is unusual, saying that it's been aware of the allegations for some time and that it's investigating.